Hey everybody, Chuck here. Um, in this video here, what we're going to look at is is uh, customer segments and making them part of the developing corporate business strategy part of the conversation. Now, according to the dictionary, customer segmentation is where we're dividing the customer base into groups of customers, and they're similar in terms of characteristics uh, and what they're looking for in terms of um, what they want to buy, how they're being sold to, et cetera. So these can be based on demographics, uh, profile-based type of customer, et cetera. And uh, we got to take these into account when we're creating corporate strategies because each of these segments identifies for us what that customer is looking for and then what they expect out of the marketplace. And so it helps us understand not only the customer, but whether or not we're going to go after that segment as a group of customers or not. So, you know, what it means is ultimately is, uh, you know, we got it, it tells us whether or not we're making or offering something that the customer wants. Uh, if they want it, they may buy it from us, but if we don't have it, uh, then they're going to go elsewhere. So understanding the customer helps us understand where we're going to play in the, the strategy conversation. And, and probably as well, I would suspect uh, it reaches a point where once we understand what the customer is looking for, we're able to answer the question, do I have a supply chain that supports that? And if not, do I want to build another supply chain to support that? Do I want to build, I guess I'd call it an offshoot of an existing supply chain? So it really drives a lot of our supply chain conversations as well. And if we want to make supply chains that align with and support um, the strategies of the company and the strategies get driven by what the markets want, we need to be part of that conversation as well.